just regarding the tweet, a uh, few of the opposition are uh, saying that you've elevated it and provoked people. What do you say to that? I think uh, it's bubble in a bubble. And do, why did you feel the need to delete it? Well, I don't think I did. I think it's, uh, it's there to read for anyone to read. Do you think it's causing offence in Indonesia? Would you apologise for that? Uh, I, I can't apologise for what people imagine. Uh, do you think it was appropriate? What? The, the tweet that what you... What tweet are you talking about? The tweet describing uh, the Indonesian figure as a... Looking like what a figure? Philip. Well, which, which figure were you talking about when you said... I don't know, because you're, you're the guy imagining a figure, mate. OK, uh, but it was regarding the Indonesia crisis. So mm -hmm. um, you said that someone... Uh, we shouldn't be apologising to someone who looks like a Filipino porn star. Who was that? No, I, no, I was not referring to anyone in particular, but if you want to imagine someone, that's uh, fine by me. Has anyone in the government told you to uh, remove the tweet? No. Have you received any comments from anyone on the government side? Uh, no. What would you say to Labor about what they are saying about your tweet? I don't know what Labor is saying, mate. Uh, one MP says that uh, it's embarrassing. Which MP? Oh, OK. We don't know. Well, we can say you that... You seem confused. No, no, uh, Michael Danby from Labor. Michael Danby, right. Oh, well, good on him. Cool. And uh, anything else? Uh, do you, what do you make of Tony Abbott's handling of the situation? I think Tony uh, is handling it very well, with great uh, aplomb and dignity. Cool. And do you th think you'll be writing any more about the Indonesia situation? I'll probably uh, might uh, put something about Indonesia in a, in a column. Uh, read the AFR, it's a fine publication.